let's talk about a story that broke earlier on today, and it's worth mentioning for those people who may have been out and are just coming in late this evening. Uh, Neymar hobbled out of uh, Brazil's training mm. today. Now, a huge concern for them ahead of their next match against uh, Costa Rica because we didn't think they'd be overly reliant on Neymar at this tournament because they seem to have a stronger squad than uh, 2014. But uh, after their, their first performance, Davian, maybe they will be very reliant on him. I don't think he helped their first performance though. I haven't liked him this year. Um, he's gone to Paris Saint-Germain. I don't like the way he plays there. He's, he's selfish, he plays for himself. I know the, the French public haven't enjoyed uh, watching him. Too much showboating for me. You look at Ronaldo, Messi, you know, they're the best. They look to kill every time. Whereas yeah. this lad, two the night against Switzerland, you know, numerous times just looking to attract three or four players over just to build a skills compilation on YouTube. You know, he's so much better than that. He's, yeah. he's utterly world class. And I just wish he played, you know, for the team more than himself. Um, and he was brilliant for them at, in 2014, wasn't he? Yeah, a million percent. Uh, you know, he's yeah. gone chasing, uh, they say, the, the Ballon d'Or, and that's why he left uh, Barcelona out of Messi's shadow. But you won't win the Ballon d'Or going to the French League. That's a fact. Yeah. Like I said, he's just been taking, trying to take the mickey all year in that league, and he gets kicked every week, top to bottom of the pitch. And it's similar again the other night. And, you know, call me a cynic, but he'll be fit for Costa Rica on Wednesday. He likes the show being all about him. He's pitcher going off the, the training pitch uh, today. He's grand. He is grand. <laughs> he might be grand, but he might be a little bit distracted, Richie. I mean, we know that he always yeah. he was inclined to go down under a challenge, but we saw an awful lot of that the other evening. I mean, do you think Neymar's mind isn't totally on this World Cup the way it should be? Totally focused on it? I, I, I think a, a fully fit Neymar, with his, with his head screwed on, with the right attitude, I think could be the standout player of any tournament. I, I, would, there was question marks over his fitness coming into this because of the injury he got a few months ago, but you've questioned there sometimes his attitude I, and I don't want to sound like an alpha here but like <laughs> the way he lives his life every report I read about him it's that he, he, you know, he loves socialising he loves having a party he's, he's for all the talent and all, all the natural ability he has there, there are loads of players have that but, but they align that with a phenomenal work rate the two greatest players in the world would be the two you think of mm. um, and, and Neymar for me lets himself down on that so whatever potential this fella has I think it's going to be hampered in this tournament because he's not probably physically at his fullest. His attitude the other night, I agree with that, was so self-indulgent. He was getting the ball and just delaying it. Just to, to have the ball at his feet, to do a couple of tricks. He slowed down play often for Brazil, so I, don't, I think, I, I'd agree, I think, you know, he could be back training in the next couple of days and playing in the next game, but he's far off, he's, he's miles off. Yeah, his full potential. And when you go back to the transfer that you, that you mentioned, Damien, most footballers would give their, give their eye teeth to play for Barcelona. And do you, do, you th do you think it was a big mistake and that his motivation, which was speculated at the time, that the motivation was purely money and that he wanted to be the number one in A side and PSG was good enough for him? I just him. think he, he's possibly run away from the challenge. You know, um, the Ballon d'Or winners, they play for the big, big clubs. I'm not sure the French league is respected like the other ones. Yeah. Um, and like I said, I've watched, I enjoy watching Paris Saint-Germain. Um, so I've watched an awful lot of them this season. And like I said, similar to the other night, he, he tracks two or three over. So there should be two free players. But he doesn't. He just wants to do his mad stuff. And listen, his skills are outrageous. He's an outrageous player. But I just wish he wasn't as selfish. Well, if Brazil are going to go all the way in the tournament, they'll need an on-form uh, Neymar, and it'll be interesting to see if he does uh, get fit enough in time for that game against Costa Rica on Friday.